Hello, I'm Michael Nagler. I'm the president of the Meta Center for Nonviolence, and this is your daily Meta for 2016. Today is January 1st. We're going to be talking about this book, uh, The Search for a Nonviolent Future, and the claim that I make in this book that the discovery of nonviolence can save us and that really nothing else can. So I'd like to start with just talking about the preface to the book. Uh, I describe in it uh, the day that I heard about 9-11. I was riding in a commute van. I was still teaching at the University of California at that time. And the radio was on in the van, and while we were riding, we heard about the disaster. And uh, when we got out of the van, the fellow sitting in front of me said, this has changed everything. And I thought, uh, th this is so right. But on the other hand, it's also so very wrong because violence is still violence. Nonviolence is still nonviolence. Nonviolence is still there to be discovered. So <clears throat> I'd like to invite you to think about a turning point perhaps in your life when you began to realize the importance of nonviolence. And for some people, it was the discovery of this book, but for others, something much more personal, more immediate. And what you think nonviolence is and why I make this claim that nonviolence can be the salvation of the modern world uh, will be the subject of our talks for this year. Thank you for listening.